Hi Saj, welcome to my channel. We're doing your um, day a uh, couple, couple June. Okay, so this is for the couple who are in an exclusive relationship. Okay, so let's see what's going on for the Saj. Okay, okay. I'm seeing here. You know, it's like for the past. I don't know how long have you felt that you're sleeping. Or you're probably still sleeping right now, but it's asking you to, one, wake up, Sag, wake up. That's for, that's for someone there. And also, it's about when you wake up, you can address a situation. So, I'm not sure if you, have in a to if you are in a toxic relationship that you need to wake up to, or something that you need to basically have some realization. It's not an awakening. It's more of like, open your eyes, because there are things that are really in front of you that you need to notice. So that's what I'm seeing here. Um, okay, oh, I guess we're starting. Okay. I'm seeing here, um, first card here, the situation you're in. Um, if you're a couple, uh, there's a lot of struggles over here, a lot of fight, a lot of, um, you know, being on the, on the guard, defensive, descent, defensive. So it can be you, you're being defensive, I'm seeing here. Okay. Oh, um, defensive because you have here. Someone keeps just throwing things at you. Like you're bringing everything up all of a sudden. That's what you're saying to your partner. Okay. Um, Page of Cups, you're asking them. It's like, where were you when, when I needed support and help and, you know, emotionally? This is what you're saying to your partner. Let me see here. Yep. And you're walking away. Eight of Cups. Okay. You're walking away from your partner. Oh, okay. Um... Knight of Cups, uh, you would want to you you would want to have, you know, a new a new feeling, a new venture over here. Knight is about freedom, and uh, you know, movement. But this Knight of Cups offers her emotion uh, fully, without knowing the risk. That's a problem with the Knight of Cups, and you have your Knight of Swords. So you you're, you're you appear to be you're moving on from someone, and you're carrying a, you know you're being a Knight Knight of Swords and Knight of Cups. Um, can be connecting with a water sign also or a, an air sign over here. I'll see someone betrayed you or you're being betrayed as a couple okay that's so why you're packing your stuff you got betrayed okay you left you, you could have probably left an, a water sign or an air sign also who betrayed you yep two of pentacles um you carried everything with you things that you couldn't handle a lot of ooh, who's this edge okay that's why probably the message was wake up empress is you know a water sign or someone that you were planning to have family with also um and the hermit, yep, so you went on a journey here by yourself, okay? So let me see now what is this journey because uh, the hermit is about knowing the answer, finding the answer, finding finding what is reality. Okay, let me see here. Queen of Swords, same thing. You're never going to let your da guard down again, okay? You are smarter now. Um, King of Pentacles, you are very established. You work your ass off after what happened with you, with this person. Page of Pentacles, there's someone also out there, an earth sign. Do be careful because they, um, I'm seeing here they are mischievous. Um, page of Wands and Page of Pentacles, they are very, very mischievous. Okay, Wands and Pentacles, someone wants to have one night stand with you or just like, you know, that kind of energy to what I'm seeing also. Um, the Hierophant, there can be a Taurus or a truth being revealed to you. This is an experience you're having also, Sedge. And they're gonna reveal the truth. Okay, so this is a truth card, Ace of Swords. Let me see what is this truth. Okay, the truth is about you have imaginary walls over here, Eight of Swords. You're putting yourself in a in a place where it's not it's not good because it's it's restricting you from growing. And look at that, Five of Cups. And here comes Mr. Drinker. Okay, like you know, my life has been wasted. I have spent my energy with you. Okay, there's so much cards here. I'm gonna do this for the Sag. Two of Cups. This can be a future relationship. The Star card, Nine of Wands, and Four of Pentacles. Okay? So I'm seeing here for your future, you have your soulmate connection, perfect alignment with the stars, or it can be an aquarium. Nine of Wands is like they're coming from a distance or, um, you know, like this requires a lot of work. But if you're waiting for that long, this is it. Almost there, Sedge. Four of Pentacles, the person, um, the person will give what you have given to them. So this is yes, this is an energy where, where we invest to ourselves, we ground ourselves. Sorry about that. I'll deal with them after. Sorry. Okay. So it's about if you reach out to the person, this person you're connecting with, who is a soulmate, they will reach out to you. Okay. So I'm channeling my inner peace because of my 
I'm really sorry. I walked them out and maybe the rain is scaring them. So I'm really not sure. I really make sure that they're tired before I do my video. Sorry. Well, thank you very much guys for watching and I appreciate your patience with my pets. I promise I'll work on them. Okay, so um, the link is down there. So you need a reading. I'll see you guys again and thank you very much for the Team Sage. Hashtag Team Sage. Bye.